Well, here we are, and um, audio doesn't work in the computer, but here I've got a bunch of Stevens, and we're walking through. I just picked them up. I actually dropped them off yesterday at the cows uh, and the chickens near uh, Falador, so I'm just walking them from there. There's quite a few of them, and um, I'm taking them to the wilderness. That's my face in the bottom right. Um, the account. Oh, that's my recording software. Okay. The account I have is this account that um, I just did all the quests, you know, free-to-play quests at the lowest level possible, got the room plate body, and then just been hanging out at the Grand Exchange, and just slowly and surely um, getting donations and stuff, uh, got, this, got the gold plate body, the gilded plate body, and the, I was saving up for the uh, gilded spade, but I uh, haven't been able to afford that yet. And so these are the stats, just the very basic to complete every quest. Um, all the quests completed there. Uh, I've got 40 defense, obviously, obviously, to wear the plate body. And the uh, attack and strengths are just from the... Uh, <clears throat> what's it called? The Vampire Slayer and the Dragon Slayer uh, rewards. So we're slowly going to go up to the wilderness and... Uh, yeah, get back to you then. Well, I just thought this part was kind of scenic, you know, walking through the monastery with the boys. So um, this really gave me this awesome idea of... Uh, really having, uh, leveling these guys up, so, um, or at least having my own uh, farm of bots like that, and you, and you bring them in to the wilderness, and uh, you hang around the multi-combat areas, and then you um, just tell them to attack people, and they just attack people, and you can give them this super high uh, defense, and um, like low strength, so just it just looks silly that um, they're just hitting loads of zeros and ones, and acting as meat shields, and... Um, that's the idea it gave me. So this was kind of funny. Um, I'm trying to get them to heal up and they won't, but uh, we've just entered the wilderness. I realize I've got to go deeper. And there I get a message from my um, boss and he's saying, uh, don't come in tonight. So that's kind of funny. First time you decide to fire up RuneScape and you get that message. Uh, what is it? Two hours before the uh, shift. So there we go. So this just kind of looked cool. Uh, you know, I've really always wanted to... Uh, have a group of uh, PKs uh, follow me around and we uh, go and uh, do that wilderness business together. And so uh, this was quite uh, cinematic, quite fun. And uh, so they're just following me, following me, following me. So I went to try a command here. I saw the iron scimitar and I said, pick it up. And they all went to pick it up. So that got me thinking, oh, okay, so I can actually equip these guys, these uh, Stevens with uh, weapons and armor. Because later on I um, tell them to equip it. And we're about to lose a, lose a Steven here, I think. Uh, and a bit later we lose a couple more before we get to the combat. But yeah, um, now that I know how to uh, get them to pick up stuff, get them to wield it, uh, I just don't know how to make them eat. Look, there, there's one goes now. So by this time I've got them to equip the wooden shield and wield the iron scimitar that one of them picked up. And so I'm just trying to get them all equipped. I said put on the iron sword, uh, bronze sword, and they all do. And then, and then I had this real trouble of getting them to attack me. I kept telling them to attack me. It worked on this other account I had. I'm not really sure what the problem was. Um, I tried a variety of uh, things. Then I get them to attack the Chaos Dwarf, and I realized that the attack function is working. Working. I just didn't know how to uh, get them to attack me. So they've just attacked a uh, Chaos Dwarf, and a few of them have died. Um, and I'm just trying to figure out how to get them to attack me. Maybe it's because I got spaces in my name or something. Um, just trying and trying and trying here. Maybe take the spaces away. Put in underscores. Finally, I crack the code when I just tell them to attack my first name. So from their eyes, they register my entire name as just that first. So the space bar seems to, uh, they don't register it. It kind of blocks it out for them. So. Just had to put in attacks there and they attacked me and so I fight them. I noticed that one of them is the same level as me. So he must have been training for a while, wherever he was. And um, yeah, I don't know how linked the, all these Stevens are really. Like uh, if one Steven is in one place, is there a boss Steven? Do they all congregate or do they split up? I don't even know. Anyway, slowly and surely I killed them all. And I'm still trying to get them to eat and heal up and I just don't know how to do it. They all had food in there in their inventories. So now I kind of uh, go back to Lumbridge um, and I realize, hey, here they all are, there's loads more of them. I'm gonna go train them up. Um, and so I take them 
all the way. Take them to uh, the cows by the cooking guild. I think I lose a few of them at Draenor. And uh, I start training them up. But then I see that they're dying too quick. And I realize, gosh, they have to be trained at chickens. And uh, that's when I kind of gave up and went home.